Hello there, welcome back to the video. So today in this video, we will be seeing how to add last refresh date and time in Power BI. The main purpose of adding the last refresh date and time is basically just that when whenever a person is viewing the report, he gets an idea if the data what he's seeing is the latest data or not. So by seeing the date and time, he can understand that the data which he is viewing is the refresh latest data or not. So let's get started with the video. So in order to add that, what we will have to do is we'll have to go to get data. And here we have this option of blank query and same option we have in transform data as well. So what we will do, we will open transform data for now and we will open that blank query option from this new source. So from this new source, we have this black query option over here at the bottom. Now here, what you have to do is you have to just paste the code which I have given in the description. The code li goes like this. This is the code which I will be giving in the description as well. You just have to copy it and paste it over here and click on enter. And after that, what you have to do is at the top left corner, you have this option to convert it to table. So when I will click on this, uh, it will show you two options, whether to convert it into a table or to list. So I have to click on to list. So the basically what will happen is it will get converted to a table with only one row and one column. And now as you can see, the data type is not correct. It is showing ABC as well as one, two, three. And now we'll have to change the data type to date and time. So we'll just click on this and we'll select the date and time option over here. Now the data type has also been corrected. Now I will just rename the column name to last refresh and the table name also I will rename to last refresh date. And I will just close and apply this. After closing and apply you can see the table has been added over here. I will just display it in a card. So I will select a card visual and I will select this thing. But there is a problem again. I want to display a text also. also. So what I will do is I will add a measure over here. I will add a new measure. And in that measure, I will add a text for last refresh date. So the last refresh date is equal to, I will add this text last refresh date and then I will add minimum of last refresh date because it will not take it directly. So I will have to use a minimum or a maximum DAX to display the date. I will hit on enter and I will add this to the card. So as you can see, I've added this to the card. Let me just in decrease the font size to 13 and disable the category label. I will also off the background. Let me make the color a bit red so that it will be visible. Now I will just adjust it so we can see here we have the last refresh date which is it is showing us 11 17 550. Now what I will do is I will refresh the table. Now it is showing 550 22 and after refreshing it will change automatically. It is now 550 22 and you can see it is now changed to 5. 5222. Okay, so this is the way how we can add last refresh date and time in Power BI. I hope you have understood the video. Thank you very much for watching the video. If you really like this video, I would request you to please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.